Hi, and welcome back to my channel. I am Diamond76, and this is Take 9. <laughs> I have done this video eight times already, and hopefully this will be the last time. And quickly, um, if you have ordered anything online and you're waiting for UPS to, um, if they are the ones that are, are supposed to be bringing you your packages, note really quickly that they are really backed up with packages i have been waiting on a package since monday and they've been sending me emails letting me know that they're going to mail it on tuesday wednesday thursday and i still have not gotten it i have been on the phone with ups all the week and like i said they are really uh swamped so if you're looking for a package that is why but I would still suggest to call them and ask them what is going on with your packages. Now, for today's video, I went to New York and Company. I went to TJ Maxx and I ordered something from Alter that I'm just getting. Um, and I have something else that's coming in and it, it was supposed to have been here on Monday and I still have not gotten it. Um... I have uh, been babysitting my grandbabies um, for the last three weeks, so, um, and I'm really trying to catch up on commenting on your videos, and I think I have, but um, I just been, you know, trying to help my daughter out uh, because she is trying to work. Um, and I want to make sure that she's able to get the kids what they need for Christmas. And that is very important to me. Um, she has, uh, four, uh, four kids, but her oldest son is in school. He's, uh, 13, but I've been watching the, uh, the, uh, she has a set of twins and she has a younger daughter. And, um, they have really been wearing me out. I'm serious. Um, my, they have been calling me my hair, which has been up like this. They've been trying to do, um, whatever they can. And they just been getting away with a lot of stuff because they are my grandbabies. And I love my grandbabies, but they are wearing Nana out. I'm telling you. And they are, it's tearing up my house. <laughs> so I'm constantly washing dishes. I'm constantly picking up toys, you know, sometimes you just have to give up, just let them go for it, and then at the end of the day, just pick up whatever it is, but let me go ahead, I'm rambling, um, the first store that I went to is New York and Company, as you can see, and what I picked up from there is this purple shirt, and I noticed that it is coming off pink on camera, but it is not, and this was $39.95. It is in a size small. And I thought this would be really cute uh, for the winter. And I may be able to wear this in the summer depending on where I go. Now, they were having a 50% off sale. So I got this for like $18 if I'm, if I'm correct. And the reason why I like this shirt is because of the buttons if you can see yeah because of the buttons that are on the shirt so that's the reason why i picked this up i think this would go really cute with a pair of jeans and a pair of well you know me they're gonna go <laughs> i'm gonna wear heels with these um whether they're pumps or on my boots so i just thought that would be really cute and the next thing that I did pick up was this jacket, and it is in a size medium. It was $59.95, and I got it for $27, I think. Um, like I said, it was having a 50% off sale. And this is the jacket that I picked up, and it is short. It's, it comes around my waist. Okay, come back, focus. <laughs> um, and like I said, what I liked it about this sweater is the pockets that are on both sides and you can utilize both pockets like like that and the uh zipper that is on here is gold and like i said um i have it zipped up right now so that way you can kind of see uh what it would look like and i just thought that was uh <clears throat> going to be perfect 
The next thing that I picked up in New York and Company was um, a pair of earrings. They had uh, buy one, get two free. And I gave the other pair to my daughter. And I picked up these two right here. If you can see them really good. And I just thought these would be really cute to add to uh, my jewelry collection. And <clears throat> excuse me too because I've been trying to fight off a cold as well. And I've been really trying to keep up with all of my friends. Um, not just subscribers but my friends. Um, but because of Vlogmas um, it's really been a struggle to try to keep up with it. But the next thing that I picked up was, let me throw that over there, was TJ Maxx. And I got these two vases right here. And they are uh, silver and they look, uh, I think it's called metallic is what it is. And I got two of these and this was $6.99 if it'll focus, okay. And um, what I'm going to do is, since my husband is moving my TV off of uh, my dresser, uh, because it no longer works anymore, um, I'm going to put a flower in these, and I'm going to sit one on one end of my dresser and the other one on the other end of my dresser. And I'm not going to pull the other one out, but I just thought these were, was really cute. And when you put your hand in, you can still see... Um, kind of on the inside of the um, of the vase and Those are the two that I got from TJ Maxx The next thing that I got was from Ulta and let me see if I can show you this without showing you my address as you, as you can see and <clears throat> What I got from Ulta is, and the reason why I keep looking over here, because I have done this like seven times, so I'm looking over here because I put something over here. The first thing that I picked up, and it was valued at $33, um, but I got it for uh, $15, is the Becca um, Economics. I think that's what it's saying right here on the box. It comes with a primer and a small travel size blush. And here it is right here and what I what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to try this out I haven't tried it out yet because I've been fighting off a cold and hadn't been feeling good and then I've been babysitting my grandbabies so I just haven't had time to try it out yet but I'm definitely going to try this out and the reason why I got the travel size and this and this is because lately I have been getting primers and mm, I haven't really liked them too much. Um, the one that I did like was the Urban Decay uh, setting primer and my daughter okay came over every day and, and she used up my uh my urban decay um uh setting spray so um and she used up my um my uh uh my primer that goes on my, my set my setting spray and my primer oh get it together so I had to uh, replace it, but I wanted to try something different. And I really heard that this was really good. And I am looking forward to trying, I'm looking really forward to trying this out. And I'm hoping that you can see this really good. But, you know, like I said, um, and then it came with the travel size blush as well in the color Songbird. And let me see if I can open it because I have on, I have on nails. So yes, I was able to open it. And this is that right there. Okay. And let's keep moving. The next thing I got from, no, I got that from somewhere else. Um, the next thing that I picked up was the Too Faced um, Pretty Little Planner. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> um, and I got this right here. I can't do this video over again because 
I just can't. <laughs> but I'm going to keep on going. Like I said, I just haven't been feeling good. And plus, I got sick last night. <clears throat> so, I picked up the uh, planner, which has Wake Up, Make Up, and Repeat by Too Faced. And on this side, it has the best year ever. And inside of it, uh-oh, I dropped the mascara on the floor. It has a mirror right here. It has a pocket right here. It comes with the eyeshadow. It comes with a calendar. And let me see if I can open it up. And that's what it looks like on that page. And that's what it looks like on that page. Really something that you can stick in your pocketbook if you, you know, if you carry a big enough pocketbook. And it also has a pocket on that side as well. And, <clears throat> oh, and it also comes with stickers as well. And this is the makeup palette right here. Let me see if I can turn that around. And that's that right there, if you can see the colors. And I do wear uh, eyeshadows. I, I do. It's just that a lot of times, when by the time I get to you, I have even washed my face and took everything off um, <clears throat> because I'm tired. Um, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, and when I get home from work, all I want to do is just take everything off, my makeup, everything, and just relax. Um, so this is, um, something that I will definitely use. And like I said, um, I do wear makeup. I just, a lot of times I take it off <laughs> when I'm on camera, but you know, that's okay. I would rather show you the real me than anything and that's that and the next thing i picked up from ulta is bare minerals um essential moisturizing soft cream and it comes in this box right here and i have been using this for about two years and i love it i love it because my skin gets so dry in the winter time it is times 10 and you would think that my skin would be, you know, real dry in the summer. No, it is worse in the winter time. And this is it right here. And a lot of times what I do do is, let me see if I can show you, just white cream. And it has a pleasant, clean scent to it. And that's the reason why I like it as well. Now, sometimes I will either use this or a primer um under my foundation what i'll do is wash my face really good put this on let it sit for mm, about five minutes and then put my primer on or sometimes i may just use it instead of using the primer so you know because i like that dewy look um because my skin is so dry i just you know, learned that when I use something matte on, you know, on my face, not necessarily my eyebrows, I mean, my eyebrows, my, <laughs> my eyeshadow, um, I noticed that my, you can really tell that my skin is really dry. So I like that, um, that, that, uh, that moisturized look or dewy finish look on my skin. The next thing I picked up was the Lash Sensational, and I got two of these, and I really like these. Um, I've been using it for about uh, six months, and I'm really loving those. And the next thing I picked up from um, Ulta is the um, Prep and Prime, um, and I got this also in a travel size bottle as well because I wanted to test it out. Um, one thing I'm learning about makeup is that makeup is really expensive. And if you're not too sure how something is going to act on your skin, then 
my initial thought was for me to buy something in a travel size, try it out. If I like it, it gives you enough time to know whether you like it or you don't. And it is important to me not to keep spending extra money on something that's full size that if I don't like it, um, I'm stuck with it and I have to use it because I bought it. So I feel like buying something in a travel size um, would help me to know if um, after wearing it for a while to know if I, if I, if I really like it. So that is that for Ulta and let me go ahead. Okay. And what I did was I went to a Morphe and I got, I want to make sure that I got everything I got from Morphe over here. I picked up the Morphe G31 brush and that is this right here and it has a slant in it right here as you can see. Now what I do is when I get new brushes, I still clean them <laughs> because this is something that is going on your face. And like I'm putting my hand on it right now, putting it in the uh, back in the plastic. Someone else could have been doing that as well, too. So that's the reason why I clean my brushes before I do use them. The next thing I got is a brush cleaner. I'm going to try this out. This is by Morphe. It's a Bristol shampoo um cotton blossom and it is um 2.1 ounce and it has a cotton blossom smell because i've already smelled it and it smells pretty good so i'm going to try this out to see how this works the next thing that i got is a highlight and contour sponge and yes it's orange red orange i think it's red <laughs> is bright i needed another one of these so i went ahead and got this right here and the last thing i got was the, the morphe 3502 palette um a uh, second nature and if my daughter see this <laughs> i can forget trying to hide it because they do watch my videos <laughs> So, um, I got this right here and let me see if I can open it because I do have on nails and okay, I was able to open it. Yay. So this is the, the 3502 palette. I'm not going to even go through it because this is all over YouTube, um, where it has been, um, reviewed and everything like that. But I thought these colors would be very perfect for me to use when going to work. And what I was, um, I noticed that a lot of the, um, YouTubers were talking about this, this plastic right here. What <clears throat> I had a thought was that what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this plastic <clears throat> and I'm going to glue right here on the end and that end right there so I can keep it in the palette but also don't have to worry about it slipping out falling out or anything like that it'll be exactly where um it is and then I can also read down to read the colors of whatever it is that I'm going to use and like I said and another reason why I got this too is because my daughter um, I'm going to link the video where she did her own eyeshadow look um, on my channel. She um, um, does a lot of beautiful, beautiful, beautiful eyeshadow looks. And like I said, this, you know, this, this is mine, but if she wants to use it, she can. Um, you know, because that's just how it is. Because like I said, she does my makeup for me a lot and um she is really good and like i said i'm gonna link that video because i know a lot of you saw the video and have been asking if she is going to start her own channel and you know it was I'm, i was really trying to get her to do that but her palettes um were kind of older and that's what she was afraid of was that she wanted to use more up-to-date palettes so 
um i just got this um like i said it's for me to use um but like i said if she wants to use it she you know she can and that is it for my haul because i'm trying to make this um as quick as possible now i entered a is that is it clear okay there we go i entered a giveaway and i won a um any field purse um on a giveaway and the uh youtube ch uh the well she's my my very good friend and her channel name is in a timely fashion what i'm going to do is i'm going to link her channel in the description box below so you can go over and watch her video she does a lot of fashion and um she can show you how to get ready for work on sundays uh from monday to fridays she also um does just um casual wear she does um well well work and casual casual wear and i think that you would really like um her channel because it's just basically based on fashion what you can wear with this what you can wear with that um and she goes very much into details um uh, because she really does care about fashion and she um is a punk lover like i am <laughs> but she shows you how you can um take something that's already in your closet and put it together, you know, so that way you can look really good on job interviews um, when you're going to work, depending. And she does also um, give you ideas based off of different types of jobs that different that people may have and how you can dress successfully on those jobs. So I'm going to list her channel below. And again, her channel name is in a timely fashion. And I'm going to go ahead and do that. But with the purse that I won, I want to go ahead and do a uh, lookbook, a get ready with me. And I'm going to go back over um, her channel again when I show the pocketbook. Because I want to do it right for her. Because she was really sweet enough, um, you know, that I got chosen to win that purse. And like I said, I want to I want to try to do her justice when I do do um, the lookbook on that purse. Like I said, I've just been babysitting my kid, my grandkids, and I've just been kind of busy, and then really kind of aggravated because UPS is not bringing me my packages, you know. And I understand because they've really been backed up, but. I'm talking really fast and I'm trying to, uh, let me go ahead and end this video. But um, thank you for watching my channel. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to thumbs up. And don't forget to click that uh, bell for any video uploads or video, video notifications that I may do. And no matter where you are in the world, day or night, I hope that everyone is having a good day or a good evening. And always remember to put that diamond touch on anything that you decide to do. And I will be seeing you guys in my next video.